Hi all, in this video we are going to discuss about how we can choose a better server for order. So first we will be discussing about the built-in server. Odo includes a built-in HTTP server which either uses multi-threading or multi-processing. For the production use, it is recommended to use the multi-processing server as it increases the stability and makes the better use of computing resources. And multi-process is enabled by configuring the non-zero number of workers. The number of workers should be based on the number of cores in the machine. So first, let's discuss what is a worker. One worker is equal to six concurrent users. So here is the calculation of worker. That is the rod of thumb equal to CPU into two plus one and cron workers needed CPU. Also, it is mentioned that one worker is equal to six concurrent users. Let's move to the memory size calculation. We consider that 20% of requests from the total requests are of heavy and with 80% are of simpler ones. And we consider that uh, an heavier worker will consume around 1 GB of RAM and the lighter worker will be around 150 MB of the RAM. And to calculate the needed RAM, we have the equation that is first we have to multiply the heavier worker ratio with the heavier worker RAM estimation. Then we have to multiply the lighter worker ratio with the writer light worker RAM estimation. Then we have to sum this both and then the results get uh, multiplies with the worker. So here is an example. So here we have that server with four CPU and eight thread and we consider uh, of a 60 concurrent users. So the worker will be 60 divided by six, which is 10. And to calculate the number of uh, maximum uh, workers, that is uh, CPU into 2, that is uh, 4 into 2 plus 1, which is 9. Out of this 9, 8 will be workers and 1 is for cron. And the monitoring system to measure the CPU load, is uh, it will be between 7 and 7.5. So to calculate the RAM from the above equation, we get the result, that is RAM is 3 GB for this example. Now we will move on to the server providers. First we will be discussing about AWS that is Amazon Web Services. The main advantage of Amazon Web Service is that it is easy to use. The, it, is, it has a user friendly interface where the server interface provides access to wide number of application and services. The usage is very simple as you can see the uh, server providers provide a documentation and it has a well documented web service api that you can use to access the platform the next important point is that it is a incredibly diverse array of tools that we can consider it as a one-stop shop for all your cloud computing and it needs next it it has an unlimited server capacity so, which is very important and AWS rules the cloud computing space. In fact, this is service that currently powers and runs hundreds and thousands of business. It is used by the million entities globally. When it comes to the security, it has a reliable encryption and security. AWS provide a more reliable secure measure which guarantees to keep your data safe which is very important in a business to secure the data. It has a 12 data centers across the world and next point is that it, it has managed IT service are available. So uh, it is a greatest benefit of AWS that it has an IT service which is easily available and uh, it can help uh, making your uh, business run smoothly and AWS offers flexibility and affordability you can choose the OS web application platform programming language and much more and moreover it is quite affordable next we are going to discuss about Rose hosting web server it offers Linux based virtual private servers and cloud hosting the main advantages of Rose Hosting are 
it manages your server that managing has to be done continuously so if you choose the managed one the company will manage and update the os packages and implement the security patches and the next advantage is that it has a regular backup data is the most valuable aspect of a business so regular backup is very must in a business so uh, this managed hosting protects you from such losses as web hosting company take the regular backup of this vital data and next is about security it ensures security that it prevents the malwares and hackers through the scanning and eviction of malware and also by filtering the spam through the regular security check and patches next is about storage that storage and db management it is also very scalable and it provides an easy scalability you can upgrade the service plan at any time so which is very useful and when it comes to the db management it is important to store the data and it has to be organized so we can retrieve it easily and should be updated regularly so this is about how you can choose a better server for uh, odo so choose your web server wisely and that's all thank you